If these street cam videos are real, then you won't believe what has been hiding from us in plain sight. 11. A 19-year-old woman emerges from the airport with a pink piece of luggage in tow. She is glad to be back in her English hometown of Plymouth after a long vacation in Italy, and all she wants to do is go home. This is the exact moment she attracts the attention of a man. He immediately becomes fascinated with her and walks out in front of her to admire her from a better angle, then turns his back so as not to be too obvious. His behavior grows even more concerning from there. He follows her all around town. He doesn't speak, just watches where she's going, perhaps hoping to get a home address for later on. The whole time they are the only two out at this late hour and by now she almost has to have sensed that she is being watched. My guess is she is trying to remain calm so he doesn't chase her, instead choosing to travel down well-lit streets in hopes that he would eventually give up and move on. After a long time though she makes a mistake and they reach the far end of a dimly lit road. Thankfully, a witness calls out from their apartment at the last second and scares him off. Police eventually track down a man and charge him accordingly. What do you think his sentence should be? Based on the extent to which he followed her, I really think that the person had an evil intention. 10. This street cam video of a train station in Navi Mumbai, video pronunciation link, India shows a boy with two loving parents who will not let him out of their sight for a single second. It seems as though they are trying their best to keep something bad from happening to him, but in reality, something already has. That's because they are not his parents at all, but rather two complete strangers who are taking him away from his real family. This was in 2014, so our only chance of ever finding out what happened is if this boy somehow escapes and tells his story much later as an adult. Still, if any viewers in India happen to have any updates to this video, or more background information, then please do not hesitate to reach out. 9. John Lethem is working at a deli in Clyde Bank, Scotland when this poor girl makes the unfortunate mistake of coming inside for a sandwich. After he snaps out of his frenzy, he frantically runs next door to buy cleaning supplies. I guess he figured that if he could clean up the kitchen, and no one would ever be the wiser. A short while later he goes out to his car, presumably clearing room in his trunk. That's all the evidence police needed to convict John Leatham, but there's still one mystery that they have not released. After disposing of her, he returns to the deli later that night and retrieves a plastic blue bag. Police have never said what was in there, but I suspect it was a keepsake or two in the form of jewelry or other personal items. 8. This alarming CCTV video comes from a radio station in Casper, Wyoming. Security is reviewing footage when they discover a tall man in a clown costume creeping behind a fence where some employees must have left their bikes not too long ago. Soon afterwards, the menacing clown is picked up on a second camera just a short distance away, and this time he stops to look directly at it. I don't know what he's been up to, or what he's planning, but something tells what he is holding probably is real and not a part of the original costume. 7. It's late at night when a street camp positioned above the entrance of a small city park records a transparent shadow with nobody nearby. The shadow person walks slowly and off balance, almost like the spirit of an old man or someone in the end stages of a serious condition. It doesn't look like a camera glitch because the image looks pretty clear and is possibly even HD, so I guess it could be editing. This also can't be somebody's shadow because, aside from the lack of a source, the shadow is also still visible when it walks out of the light and into the darkened corner. 6. There's a mysterious red box on this sidewalk in the middle of the day. No one seems to bat an eye at it, except for one man who seems to keep circling back to check it out. Is this his box or is he suspicious of what it's doing there? More predestrants walk by as the man on the bicycle circles back again and this time grabs the box. He holds it against his chest as he speeds off. What could possibly be inside that box? 
it turns out that it sadly was donation money in there, which explains why this mysterious man was acting this way. But now that we know exactly what it is, it sucks he would take donation funds. 5. A girl is walking down the street in Kalumit City, Illinois when a large man walks out from behind his red vehicle directly in her path. Something about him feels off, so at the 15 second mark the child stops, but instead of turning around or crossing the street, she decides to try and rush by him. She was later able to escape the vehicle and flag down help before anything else could happen. Still, this video, which is barely over a minute long, shows how easily this could happen in an instant. Even in broad daylight, and even in your own neighborhood. 4. A lone groundskeeper is tending the Washington Nationals field late at night when a total lunatic stomps towards him in wide, uneven steps, arms flailing wildly. It's hard to tell if this is a zombie or a deluded fan. Whatever it is that's going on here, the custodian does respond realistically. He doesn't ask any questions, just runs away at top speed as soon as he notices it's not a fellow maintenance worker. Meanwhile, whoever, or whatever, is following him looks to be in bad shape and unable to run. When they get closer to the camera a short while later, both their nose and appear to be in a bad state of decay. One of the eyes is covered in darkness and could very well be missing. 3. A mountain lion wanders the streets of Granada Hills, California, probably in search of a meal. Eventually it decides to stop at this local high school and roam around. Everyone is still inside as the wildcat treats the high school like its own personal hunting grounds. He leaps to a higher vantage point to jump down on any prey it can find. Police and wildlife officials arrive before that has a chance to happen. They quickly tranquilize the animal, but it is so large that it wanders around half stunned. They ultimately released it back into the wild hopefully in new location far away from any high schools. Two. It's late at night when a small humanoid figure creeps across a small town, moving slow and low to the ground so as not to alert anyone nearby. At first glance it looks like it could simply be a child who got out of their parents' sight and is now wandering around on their own, but its proportions are all wrong. The creature looks fully mature, at least for its size, and its head is much bigger than its body, which looks stick-like in comparison. This small grey creature looks to be roughly the same size as their humanoid in the street cam video from Turkey. The chances of two separate channels on opposite sides of the world faking this same creature seems pretty low, so both street cam videos could be real. 3. I've got a challenge for you, since you've made it this far, why not like this video and hit subscribe in the next 5 seconds, because Vampira Plays upload 4 new scary videos every week. One. You would think that our street cams would be secure from malicious exploits, but this British security expert is going to show us how easy it is to take over webcams and CCTV systems using a simple program. Almost every type of account will lock out the user after a certain number of failed password attempts. Our emails and social media have them, but street cameras don't. This means programs like this password cracker can gain access in minutes. Basically, it guesses every word in the dictionary almost instances until it finds the right phrase that's your password. And from there, it can see exactly what you're doing at any given time. You would never know if not for this video explaining how it's done. So now think of the possibility that someone has already done this to your computer and they've been watching you for a long time.